Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showing you how to connect your Xbox One controller to your PC and play Rocket League with the Epic Games launcher. There are many reasons you might want to do this, but the main reason I'm thinking is there is a lot of Xbox players moving to PC, but they don't want to have to settle for the mouse and keyboard. Or maybe you're not doing so well with the mouse and keyboard and want to try out some new controls. Whatever the case may be, I'm going to be showing you how to do that in this video, so make sure you stick around to the end so you don't miss out. Anyways, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so there's two ways that you can do this. First way, you can do it with a USB cable, which is the wired option. And to do that, what you want to do is just get a random USB cable, preferably longer, and then just go ahead and plug it into your PC or laptop. And then get your Xbox One controller, and then plug the other end of the USB into it, and then you'll be all ready to go. And you can just go straight in and jump into a game of Rocket League. So the second way you can do this is the wireless route. And to do this, you're going to have to unpair your Xbox One controller from your Xbox. And that's what I'm going to be showing you how to do that right now. So first thing you want to do is just go ahead and turn your Xbox One controller on. After you do that, what you want to go ahead and do is just get a USB cable and plug it into your PC. After you go ahead and do that, just go ahead and get your Xbox One controller. Plug it into that same slot as you did before. And then after you do that, you just want to go ahead and press the sync button on top of your Xbox One controller for 5 seconds. After you do that, you just want to go ahead and unplug it. And now it's unpaired from your Xbox. And how you know it's unpaired is because it will be blinking really fast. So next what we're going to go ahead and do is pair it to Bluetooth. Also, I know that some of you guys might not have a Bluetooth card in your PC or laptop, but if you do, you can skip this part. But if you don't have a Bluetooth card, I'd recommend that you go ahead and pick up one of these off of Amazon. I'll have a link in the description down below. They're only like five or six bucks and they work exactly like a normal Bluetooth card. So what you wanna do with this is just plug it straight into your computer. And you'll get this Bluetooth icon pop up in your computer. You just wanna go ahead and press that and press show Bluetooth devices. And this is just an easy way to shortcut to your Bluetooth settings. Next, what you want to do is press add Bluetooth devices and then press on the very first one that comes up. Next, you want to get your Xbox controller and make sure it's on and then go to the very top of your controller and hold down on the Bluetooth connect button. And then your Xbox wireless controller will show up and then you just want to press it on it and then it will automatically connect to your controller. And after it's connected, you can just go ahead and press done. And then you could just go ahead and hop into a Rocket League game with your friends. So that's how you connect an Xbox One controller to your PC and use it with Rocket League on the Epic Games launcher. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't, give this video a like and subscribe to this YouTube channel so you don't miss out on more content just like this. And also, if you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to comment down below because I reply to every comment that comes in. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.